Peace to everybody. This is about R. Kelly's girlfriend, Joyce Sonny Savage, issued apology, ready to tell all. So she's ready to tell all, huh? Okay, so here we go in the screenshot. We got R. Kelly with Joyce Lynn Savage, one of R. Kelly's alleged girlfriends. One of R. Kelly's mistresses, Joyce Lynn Savage, is coming forward with her own story. So she's going to be coming forward with her own story. While R. Kelly sits behind bars awaiting multiple trials on child pornography and sexual abuse charges, his two infamous girlfriends have been proclaiming his innocence and holding him down since he was arrested over the summer. Joycelyn Savage, 23, and Azrael Clary, 21, have been defending their alleged abusive boyfriend against public slander and accusations that the two were being held against their will. The two went as far as to appear on CBS this morning and told Gail King that they were in happy, healthy relationships with Kelly, despite pleas from their families for them to come home. So you got Joycelyn Savage, who is 23, and Azrael Clary is 21. Um, they've been defending their alleged abuse of boyfriend against public slander and accusations. So does this mean those two were making up stories that may or may not have been true? Um, Joycelyn, she appeared on CBS this morning and told Gail King that they were in happy, healthy relationships with Kelly, despite the pleas from their families for them to come home. But even though the parents of Joyce and Savage and Asriel Clary, they have been trying to get them back for a long time because, you know, R. Kelly allegedly was holding the girls against their will. And they, um, so now... I guess the tables are turned or something like that. I don't know what is going on with Joyce Lynn Savage and Azrael Clear because those two can't make up their minds what they want to do. Both Savage and Clary's parents have been vocal in the media about not being able to see or contact their daughters since they became involved with Kelly. So yeah, so the parents of these two girls, they've been vocal in the media. Um, they also are vocal in the media about not being able to see or contact their daughters since they became involved with Kelly. So there, no matter how hard the parents were trying, and as you can see here, here's a screenshot. I do believe this is Joycelyn um, Savage or Azrael Clary. I'm not sure which one of the girls it is, but it's, I mean, it's t hard to tell them who's who. The tides may be starting to turn. However, in an Instagram page believed to have belonged to Joycelyn Savage posted a cryptic message Friday with the caption, I'm sorry, there's something I need to reveal. Something I should have talked about a long time ago. This is my story. The message read before Friday. It had been over two years since a photo was posted to that account. So it's been two years since it was po that she posted anything on Instagram. Um, of course, she had it in caption, I'm sorry, there's something I need to reveal, something I should have talked about a long time ago. This is my story. So whatever story she has, she needs to come out with it. But then, of course, of course she told Ke Gail King uh, uh, that she's uh. in a happy, healthy relationship with Kelly. I, you know, I really find it hard to believe because, you know, things are not always what you think they are. Savage's parents were featured in the Emmy-nominated docu-series, Surviving R. Kelly. 
that air to generate and prompted law enforcement to take a more in-depth look into the singer's conduct with women. Since then, Kelly has been hit with several charges, including child pornography, sexual abuse, kidnapping, and obstruction of justice as more alleged victims came forward about their relationships with him. While they were underage, Joycelyn Savage met Kelly at a concert when she was 19. She and Clary had both claimed that their parents just wanted money and fame. R. Kelly denies all allegations made against him and pleaded not guilty to federal charges in August. Well, R. Kelly is still sitting in jail, yes, with multiple charges against him right now. Um, Savage's parents were featured in the Emmy-nominated docuseries Surviving R. Kelly, and that aired in January, prompted law enforcement to take a more in-depth look into the singer's conduct with women. Oh, I, I, this, I mean, yeah, with R. Kelly having multiple charges against him, then you got the alleged sex tapes going around. Um, and of course, several charges, including child pornography, sexual abuse, kidnapping, and obstruction of justice. This is why R. Kelly has been hit multiple times with charges. Um, and of course, alleged victims came forward about their relationship with him while they were underage. Joycelyn Savage met Kelly at a concert when she was 19, so she was an adult because with a woman at age 18, they are adults. And Clary have both claimed that their parents just want money and fame. R. Kelly denies all allegations made against him and pleaded not guilty to federal charges in August, so that's what he did. He pleaded not guilty, but still... I, I would not trust him because of all the underage girls that are under the age of 18 or 17. Yeah, that's pretty sickening. And of course, here's Joycelyn Savage's um, Instagram post. This is what she wrote on her, on her, I guess maybe whatever it was. And then she wrote it on and she posted it to her Facebook. Um, Instagram account and of course you know Joycelyn Savage man, I don't know she needs to tell the real truth or something because you know right now she's flip-flopping and she don't know which way to go and that goes the same with Azrael Clary too they're both flip-floppers so who knows who what and where they're where they're Minds are going. Leave your comments below. I am out.